so we're just gonna do a little experiment today. We're gonna see how uh, water reacts to diesel fuel, and then we wanna see what it looks like after we add fuel locks to it. Um, fuel locks is a demultiplier, so that means it separates the water from the oil. The problem with the fuel around this part of the world is that sometimes through storage or through poor refining, we get water in the fuel, and uh, fuel locks will help us get rid of that problem. All right, so we're just gonna add diesel fuel to Container right here. Closed. Yeah, it's closed. Alright, so it's regular diesel fuel. I'm gonna add water to simulate a larger tank. That may have water at the end, and you can see that the water moves pretty freely in here, which means it can also mix pretty freely into the uh, oil and cause problems in your engine. Alright, we're just gonna add a bit of fuel ox to this. Right. And then you'll see that the water moves as a, uh, once it's mixed, yeah, the water will move as sort of a singular body and the fuel sort of rejects the water. So you see that here, which means then at the end you can dr very easily drain off the water from the bottom of the tank, which will save your engine. All right, so we're just gonna drain off. I got it. Right. Drain off the water from the bottom of the tank. All right, we're almost there, then. pretty much clean diesel. There you go. And we get a better quality fuel and you won't get water in your engine.